So dolls, a lot of people say that I, they want to see me cook more. They don't believe, a lot of people do not believe that I actually use my pink kitchen. They just think I like to, you know, it's for show. No, I do a lot of cooking in here. I enjoy cooking. Dolls, when I say my soul almost departed my body, I don't know if you caught that, but my eyes went in like that direction. There's a shadow. It was like a car driving past and the shadow of the car driving past made me think a human or animal literally just went past me. So my soul, I, I could have literally like passed out on camera. I, I was like, that's why I had to cut the camera. I was like, what was that? We need to stop vlogging. This is really important. But anyway, <laughs> I lost my train of thought because of that. What are we going to be doing? We're going to be doing pasta. So this pasta, dolls, head to Walmart. You need it. You literally need this pasta in your life. Dolls, I have the perfect stuff. Look at this spatula. I got this on Amazon and I'm going to link this, of course. <laughs> it's got a, like a cute love heart in the middle and then it's like a pink love heart spatula. That's what I'm going to be using for this video. I also got this bowl. I don't know which bowl to use, whether I should use this bowl. I got it from Target. I think this was like $3. Look, I don't know whether to use this bowl or whether to use, let me show you. This is also from Target. The flat plate, look at this, with a love heart. How much is this? Yeah, I think this was $3 as well. And it's like pink. I don't know which one to use. What do you think I should use? Well, by the time you watch this video, we've already filmed it. <laughs> but look at that, how cute is that? So grab your spatula, grab your apron, grab your spoons, grab everything you need, and let's go and do some Valentine's Day love heart pasta. Let's go. That is my dream. I've changed tops because we're about to get gritty. <laughs> so come on in dolls, come to my kitchen. I feel like, I feel like this is something for Vogue. Like, welcome in Vogue. Welcome into my kitchen. Let's cook. <laughs> so you will need pasta. So I'm gonna be using this Barilla pasta from Walmart. You're gonna need this. Look at the love hearts dolls. Oh my God, I can't get enough of this. I almost don't wanna use it because it's so pretty, but we're gonna to have to use it. So you're gonna need those. It has 200 calories, by the way. So yeah, one box should be okay. So that's the product you're gonna need. You're gonna need this, which is a ribbed cup. I think this is just so cute. You can use any cup actually, but I'm gonna be using this ribbed cup here, coupe. And I love it because, I mean, I loved anything ribbed, as you can see. So I'm gonna be having that for my drink. To go inside there, I'm gonna be using these Love Heart ice cubes. And you're probably wondering what is inside there. They are sprinkles. I just wanted something pink in there and red. So <laughs> they melted weird. I don't know why. Don't ask why I added sprinkles inside an ice cube, but I needed something. I could have put a rose in there. Like, that's that. <laughs> Dolls, trust me to find something pink. Pink, pink, I said pink. Pink cranberry juice from Walmart Ocean Spray. And just look at that. I never knew they had that. So this is new. And we can't do Valentine's Day without something pink to drink, right? Had to get that. I thought I'm going to blend it with poppy. Let me show you what I'm going to use. So this poppy drink would go really good. I don't know. I feel like I can mix it with the cranberry. And if you want to add alcohol to spike this you can but i'm not we're just going to be doing non-alcoholic um virgin mocktail so <laughs> that's that you're going to need obviously your love heart pasta bowl or plate i still don't know if i'm going to use the plate or bowl but you're going to need something valentine's day ish and you need this and they're only three dollars from target you're going to need well i'm using turkey um, turkey meat I'm not going to be using beef um, so we're going to be using turkey meat so I'm using lean turkey and that's what I'm going to be making the stew with and I decided to have some garlic bread that is already done but I'm still going to add my own cheese and bake it so I'm going to add my own cheese and herbs on top of that but um, I'm going to be having some garlic bread on the side just to have something carby on the side well <laughs> the pasta is already carby but you know what I'm trying to say just to zhuzh it up <laughs> Here's a cheese that you cannot live without when you're doing pasta, Parmesan cheese. I mean, do I need to say any more? <laughs> and some mozzarella, but let me show you something. Look at what they did. Look at, so I've not opened this just to show you, it's sealed. Look what Walmart did. 
Look where, look how much cheese I actually get. Look how big the, like the packaging is. Inflation. That is inflation. Look at that. Can you see it? Like, I'm so mad. Look at how much packaging is there. That's air. That's literal air. Look at that. And then look where the cheese is. <laughs> Sorry, I just feel cheated. <laughs> I feel cheated by my cheese. I love cheese and I just feel so cheated. So now we have all of the stuff we're going to need. Obviously, the spices and sauce is not on video. Like, I'm not showing you right now. But we've got all of our main, main, main ingredients just sitting here ready to go. So I guess we're ready to start cooking. I'm excited. I've never done a video like this before on this channel. I am excited to see how this pasta comes out. And if the, um, my fear is that these shells are going to stick together. <laughs> I don't know why. Or they're not all the, or it's not going to be a love heart. I don't know. I just have fears about it. So fingers crossed this comes out well. I'm still going to post it even if it's a flop, but I hope that pasta stays in the form of a love heart. But I've heard good reviews that it actually stays in the love heart shape. So fingers crossed it comes out perfect. Look at those love hearts. Look at these. So then they just let that boil. Look at them. They actually look so perfect. Like usually people say that they, other brands, that it kind of breaks up. But this one, so far, it's not done cooking. It looks good. Now I'm going to put some salt in here and start, well, they're getting kind of stuck together. I'm going to season this and start making, working on this while the pasta is boiling. So I love my like sauce to be very seasoned. I'm gonna add some, this is what I'm adding, Old Bay seasoning. And this is for like meat, fish, and all of that kind of stuff. So I'm gonna like, I'm going heavy handed on this because I love flavor. So that is what I'm adding. I'm just gonna let that sit in there before I stir it. I'm gonna add a bit of this, which is poultry season. So that's for like any kind of, again, meat. And I'm just putting, a little bit and this makes me sneeze seasoning makes me just start sneezing when it's got certain like spices inside it a bit of paprika is going in here some parsley flakes is going to be inside here i don't even know what taste they give it but they just look good <laughs> i'm gonna empty it from here because it's just i like using a lot okay <laughs> so yeah it's starting to come along well we're like almost done it's almost like cooked some ground camino cum can't say this one properly but i'm going to be adding that inside here ground cumin i don't know why that was so weird to say i think it's because it's written in spanish so it's just different to me i don't know why that looked strange to me but yeah adding some of that and our pasta is almost done so i'm going to just mix all of that in starting to it smells really good i wish you can smell this and then Italian seasoning. We can't do something Italian without adding some Italian seasoning, right? Can you use a little bit of the Italian seasoning? I say a little and I just keep going. <laughs> and this is almost done. One more thing. And I'm just gonna stir this. I forgot before the curry powder, I forgot to add thyme. So I'm gonna just like put a little bit of thyme in there. Can't do anything without thyme. Now, curry powder. I love curry powder. It tastes so good. It stains my nails, but it's so worth it. The taste is so good. So, I'm going to just mix that in. I love the colour. I'm going to mix it in. And then once it cooks a little bit more, I'm now going to add some pasta sauce to this. Look at that colour already. Look at the colour. I love the way curry powder gives things a good colour. My pasta is done, so I'm going to take turn it off because it's overcooking before the love hearts break up. I 
and dolls i think we are done it looks really really good i love when my sauce is just red <laughs> i love that color and i feel like this is like the best um spaghetti sauce color that you can ever get so i'm going to put it on the i feel i feel like i'm done i feel like there's something i feel like there's something missing but i feel like we're done i'm gonna put it on the pasta now my garlic bread is actually done so i'm gonna put the garlic bread on the pasta and then i'll put the meat sauce on there dolls look at this it is so good look 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 oh my god it looks so delicious now i'm going to make a drink <laughs> and then i'm gonna add the sauce on and then we're gonna end this video because i'm so hungry once i see the food i just want to eat so i'm gonna make a drink and let me show you look at this so i'm gonna be adding that cranberry juice inside here and this is just a marshmallow from dollar tree and this little pick love heart pick is from dollar tree and i'm gonna just be adding that in here it's gonna look so cute so this is the drink i made with the marshmallow the love heart it's so cute and it matches the meal perfectly with the little love heart stick. I am obsessed. Pink cranberry actually is pink. You know, some things say pink, but they're not really pink. This is actually pink and I love it. It's so good. Like imagine me putting a rose in there. Oh my God, so perfect. And this is non-alcoholic. So that's that. Look at that. <laughs> so I'm about to add some sauce. Oh, this looks so good. Dolls, look how it turned out so perfect i literally cannot wait to end this video so i can eat it <laughs> look how it turned out made some pasta i love it valentine's day pasta look how gorgeous that looks i cannot wait to eat i'm waiting for this cheese to melt it's taking forever but i cannot wait to eat and i'm scared of microwaving this to make that cheese melt because i feel like the plate is gonna burn so we're gonna leave it i don't trust this plate <laughs> but yes it is just so good and i can't wait to eat it just oh, love it i'm gonna include parts of the recipe 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 <laughs> recipe below in the comment section i'll pin the recipe everything i used um as much as i can but yes it is just so delicious i am so glad we could do some cooking um i had fun doing it i love how it turned out i just can't wait to eat this i am ready to turn this video off so i can actually eat it <laughs> so dolls here we have it i hope you enjoyed this video if you want to see more videos of me cooking just doing life stuff let me know in the comment section down below the secret word of today's video because we did do cooking hmm so dolls if you're new to my channel at the end of every video i have a secret emoji that i like you dolls to comment in the comment section it helps me know who has been watching to the end of the video and today's secret emoji of this video is going to be because we did like italian pasta let's do i was going to say the italian flag but let's do yeah let's do the italian flag and the spaghetti emoji in the comment section down below i enjoyed making this and i enjoyed doing this video dolls i love it so comment that in the comment section down below thank you so much for watching dolls i enjoyed this cook with me video it's different i definitely want to do more different videos in the new year and i mean this is the new year <laughs> i definitely want to do more videos like this like where you get to spend more time with me in my apartment and just in life in general i enjoyed it thank you so much for watching if you're new to my channel subscribe if you enjoyed this video give it a big fat thumbs up thank you so much for watching run to walmart now and get yourself that pasta it is so good and even the cranberry juice as well that i used it for it's Mm, chef's kiss go to walmart and get yourself not sponsored sponsor me walmart <laughs> thank you so much for watching dolls and i see you in my next video smooches bye my loves